Interview and job search strategies that work. I'm in the gym. I'm in the actual sauna room right now. There's a person who was in here, just left. And uh, he owns like a, um, a business doing like uh, oil uh, additives. Anyway, so I was asking him, you know, what was his biggest uh, hurdle? He said, you know, he's uh, almost 70 years old. And he said the last two years were... Um, gravy, and he said, getting started, the thing that mostly um, hindered him was um, getting the initial inertia, which I take it to mean uh, uh, consistency or uh, momentum, basically. So, if you if you know somebody who runs a business, just just ask him. You never know who your next best friend is going to be or who you're going to meet, and, and try to just decipher their code, basically. I'm sure they're more than willing to uh, help you uh, navigate the, the path or just give you little tips and tricks like that because most people out there don't take the initial step. Um, they're, you know, it's, it's just how it is sometimes. Um, you know, and, and what happens is a lot of whatever that is, if it's IT, if it's uh, whatever. So taking the first step is, is really critical and just building on that actually. And um, something small, you know, you're trying to jump into something big, like IT-wise, like become, go from, say, like just a McDonald's worker, Walmart worker, let's say, to going sysadmin, yeah, discouragement's, you know, qu um, it's, sometimes there's discouragement, and, you, oh, okay, yeah, it's not for me. But if you take those baby steps, it's like, oh, okay, let me take, you know, just a small step at a time, what you're going to find is, you can be able to build on that uh, that information that uh, you know it's pretty much the stuff uh, what Walter my last uh, last episode I had Walter Holmes check it out episode uh, 71 was talking about um, same kind of thing but uh, yeah okay so that does it for this uh, podcast um, thanks a lot for everybody listening have a great day